And yeah, when they're all together, they can drop an enemy like nothing, but it's either smart to separate them or put them all together. I usually put them all together around a blind corner, so if an enemy like walks by, they get caught by it and they're slowed down and they're trying to get out of it, and it's just damaging them as well. And I usually hang out by my sentry turrets also, because her right trigger, this is like a gun that's for up close, and it kind of locks onto them. And I just imagine it taking all their life and it kills them pretty fast. Not really, really fast, but their life drops very low, especially around her sentry turrets. So that's why I use her as a um, defense. She's just a really awesome defending character. I don't see anybody really hating on her unless they don't know how to use her. But And a lot of people might think she's weak, but I can actually get kills if I'm versing one guy all by himself. And I usually just use the up close, um, I don't know what this is called, wait. Right trigger, uh, the photon projector, or whatever it is. But it connects to them, and yeah, like I said, it just takes their life away. And while I'm up close, I jump left and right, I jump everywhere, and they can't even hit me. And then it's slowly taking their life. Now that's Tracer, she's going to be kind of hard to kill. And left trigger shoots out um, little orbs, and if you hold it down, it powers up and shoots a big one. It does quite a bit damage when connected. So as you guys can see, that took down her life like crazy. Oh, and also, uh, Symmetra's super ability, I'll just call it super, just like Destiny, that's what I usually call it is she sets down a teleporter and that's even more overpowering so she's like not even a weak character at all she's overpowered but I really hope they don't change her she's really awesome she's really weak too but you just have to know how to counter her and that's kind of with range except a tank like that up close can kill you really easy so they're taking out my turrets my sentry turrets there's a teleporter and like I said all the way from spawn you don't have to walk all that way and you're already at the battle and this is how most battles are won by keep on spawning and pushing them back and they can't really do much about it it's crazy I'm just cha chasing Tracer right now she probably knew I was chasing her he probably knew I was chasing her a lot of guys play female characters like myself I don't do it because like I like it, but they're just really great characters. In Gears of War, guys usually pick the girl characters just to look at their asses when they're running. Sometimes, I, I don't know, I heard somebody say they do that. <clears throat> or they pick them mostly because they're really thin and skinny and they're just a harder hitbox to hit. That's what I heard. And it's kind of true because the Theron guard is really big and when he's behind cover you can shoot his back and it damages him. When you shoot a different character's back it really doesn't do anything. But yeah, I might, I'm might. i most likely going to buy this game. Right now I can buy it but I'm probably going to wait till I get more money and then I'll buy it. But Like I said, I just jump left and right and just hold down that trigger and you'll kill him pretty much. I killed Roadhogs quite a bit, but that one really got me. And they took out the, uh, either they took it out or the, uh, portal dies on itself. I really don't know, but if you're going to play Symmetra, always play your, um, or <laughs> always put your, um, teleporter somewhere where nobody will find it and some somewhere that's pretty close. That's all I could say. Also, you could, I think I already said this, you can give people um, a 25, 25, um, what's it called? I can't remember. A shield, a 25 shield or something. And they're capturing A right now. It would have been helpful if I would have stayed alive and set down my teleporter. I think they're going to capture it. Unless my team all can get in there. No, there's two of them already died, so. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be capturing it. Hope so, but. Oh, yeah, they captured it. 
So whenever they capture, just fall back. There's no point in trying to keep fighting unless you can find a good blind co corner and set down your sentries. Always set them down, yeah, like I said, behind blind corners so whenever somebody runs, they're going to run right into it. Uh, I really don't know where to set my um, portal. I think I'll set it down around here, but I don't know. I'll set it down right there. It's pretty close. I don't think anybody will find it. Right here is where I usually set down my sentry turrets. I usually set them down really high. Or in a three like this. Now that guy's an asshole, he's taking out my turrets. I'll probably go kill him if I can. So when you're Symmetra, always make sure you're um, checking if all of your team has 25 shields. <laughs> and at the beginning, I really thought I was going to play the Reaper. Like I thought he was going to be my most played character. I thought I was going to... I thought I already said it, he was going to be my go-to character right when I saw him. But when I played him, I was kind of a little upset and... Not really what I was expecting, but yeah, he's a pretty good character as well for attacking. And as you can see, we are pushing back the payload, which is good. We're putting up a good fight, and this is why Symmetra is perfect for having her on the team. Because her um, teleport comes in handy, especially for pushing enemies back. They could get right back into the fight and really close to them instead of having to walk all that way from the uh <laughs> you guys saw that turret my turds kill him but yeah it's a long walk when you gotta walk back from your spawn so that's why symmetra is a really good character hardly anybody plays her also i don't really get why people don't really play her as much she's kind of like I would recommend her, she would have to be required for the team on defending. And it doesn't mean you'll lose if you don't have a Symmetra on the team, but she's always great and she's really helpful. And yeah, like I said, this game's like a lot like Rainbow Six Siege. There's nothing really you can really do in over Rainbow Six Siege um, besides keep on playing and keep on just keep on playing just to unlock cool stuff like the. I don't really know what you unlock in Rainbow Six, but that's what this is like. You just keep on playing to unlock the skins. And that's pretty much it. I still play Rainbow Six Siege to this day. And we're gonna win right now. Do the emote, do the emote. Yes. So that's gonna be it for this video. I got an unboxing video waiting, so if you guys watch this, the unboxing video should be up and ready, possibly, or the next day, but. I'm Noisy Bear and I'll see you guys in the next video. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. If you guys like this video, hit that like button. And I'll see you guys in the next video.